Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 20 console boot up screens. For this list, we're naming off the most iconic boot up screens from across game console history. Which boot up screen is your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. Number 20, Nintendo Wii. Most consoles started with a simple animation of the logo and threw you into your game. The Wii, on the other hand, focused more on gently welcoming the player. After ignoring the health warning for the upteenth time, the Wii's dashboard lights up the screen and plays a chime that evokes that Nintendo charm. The ambiance was soothing enough that we'd sometimes just leave the console on and relax. The Wii's given off chill vibes. Number 19, Sony PSP. The PSP may not have been a runaway success for Sony, but it still stood on its own two legs. Those who bought a PSP found a startup screen that was somewhat similar to the PS2 in terms of visuals and style. Audio, on the other hand, was admittedly a bit jolting due to the sudden echo of the PSP's logo. Hey, at least the handheld got you woken up and ready to play. Number 18, Nintendo 3DS. As we'll see throughout the list, Nintendo's handhelds have had some fantastic snappy intros to quickly greet players before getting them into their game. The Nintendo 3DS was no exception. Not only were the red waves cool to look at, but when the 3D slider was at max, it showed just how cool the 3D aspect was. But we gotta ask, did anybody else find it hypnotizing? Quick, someone make a 10 hour loop of this. Number 17, PlayStation 5. We've been so used to booming sounds and short pieces of music that it's hard to think of another way to impact players. The PlayStation 5 takes a drastically different approach than its predecessors this time around. Instead of a loud sound effect, the PS5 opens up with a calm ambiance and a lovely sting as the screen opens up with sparkling particles. Pretty, elegant, and a quiet way to get ourselves premeditated for gaming. Number 16, Sega Dreamcast. The Dreamcast will always be remembered as Sega's graceful swan song as they departed from the console market. We'll never forget the fantastic games that captivated the few gamers who owned the console. Collision detection is actually on the body rather than in the form of a cylinder around the player. Of course, there was something mesmerizing about seeing that red dot turn into a spiral, and that soft ambient sound would become another memorable tune in Sega's repertoire of iconic gaming sounds. You'll forever remain in our hearts, Dreamcast. Number 15, Xbox. Really, consoles are just bundles of microchips and wires, but it's more fun to think of them as futuristic technology powered by nuclear energy. At least, this was the idea Xbox may have had in mind with its first console. Uh, Bill, do you have any idea what The Rock would be like if he were only running on one-fifth of his power? Well, I, I would think that... It doesn't matter what you think, Bill. The original Xbox opens with a blob mutating before zooming out to show the logo. It's not the greatest of the Xbox boot-ups, but Microsoft made a hell of a first impression with this. Number 14, Nintendo Entertainment System. Hey, we're just as surprised as you are. 
Back in the 80s and early 90s, we didn't have much when it came to boot up screens. You just put in the cartridge and bam, you're playing the game. However, those who started their Famicoms or NES systems without a cartridge found a special startup screen where Mario and Luigi flicked the Nintendo logo lights on and off. You don't see cute stuff like this on dashboards. Number 13, Sega Saturn. Powering on the Sega Saturn was almost like bringing the future into our living rooms. And we aren't just saying that because of the Saturn's impressive 3D visuals. The system opens with a collection of squares flying across the screen and coming together to form the logo. It's as if pixels were separating and coming together to form better visuals. Simple, yes, but an elegant way for players to step into a new generation of games. Number 12, Steam, Big Picture Mode. In its basic form, Steam's startup screen is nothing more than a small box to type in your login info. When starting Big Picture Mode, however, you get a whole new experience. Noises of water give off the feeling of submerging underwater when coupled with the pixelated particle effects. It's a cool presentation, yes, but we are a little confused by the water part. Isn't the platform called Steam? Eh, whatever, it's still neat. Come join in. Number 11, Xbox Series X slash S. As consoles improve their performance, so too have their presentations, and this one was certainly better than the original Xbox. When turning on the Xbox Series X or S, the system kicks off with a soft outline of the Xbox logo as the music gently crescendos, as if seeing a sunrise or a knight in shining armor. Like the PS5, it's a nice quiet change from the past's booming beginnings. Number 10, PlayStation 3. For a console as chunky as the PS3, one would anticipate a powerful noise similar to Sony's previous consoles. However, the PS3 clearly wanted users to feel like the console was ready to put on a show specifically for you in your own private theater. And what better way to invoke that fantasy than by emitting the sound of an orchestra opening up for a concert? This was a show made for you. Number 9, Ouya. Few consoles evoke a sense of power that gets you psyched to start playing some games. There are also few consoles that flopped as hard as the Ouya did, but that doesn't take away from just how awesome its boot-up screen is. Ooh, yeah. After a few seconds of the glimmering logo, the console greets you with a mighty Ouya! Hell of a way to greet players! If only more bought it! Buy now at Ouya.tv Number 8, Nintendo DS. Similar to the Wii, the DS had a startup screen that was a little more like a dashboard, but we'll still allow it on this list. After all, it's known for its simple visuals and tone. Users were welcomed with two small squares meeting to form the Nintendo DS logo, playing a light chime as soon as they were connected. The noise is almost reminiscent of another Nintendo handheld, but we'll get to that soon. Number 7, Xbox 360. One could say that this was the sound that defined a generation. What Xbox 360 owner could forget the first time they booted up the console and saw those vibrant green streams fly across the screen? With the Xbox 360 hosting a ton of great titles, the faint echo was quickly ingrained into our heads. The Xbox One would have a similar noise, but you just can't be the classic. Number 6, Neo Geo. It may not be as recognizable as the bigger game companies, but the Neo Geo boasted a tune just as catchy and memorable. 
Turning this console on would start with a white screen and the logo being flipped around, ending with the SNK logo fading in. It's a sequence that has resonated with those who grew up in the early 90s, as well as many folks within the fighting game community. Number 5. PlayStation 2 Given that this was and still is the best-selling console of all time, almost everyone should recognize the magnificent sounds of a PS2. The coolest part about it was how all of the tiles and towers represented the storage space in your memory card and how many games you played. Though, God help you if you inserted a broken disc into the machine. Then you'd enter a new kind of hell. Literally. Number 4. Game Boy Advance Handhelds like the PSP and Nintendo's DS family were great, but when you think of handhelds, there's only one system that comes to mind, the Game Boy Advance. Game Boy Advance. In addition to holding a wealth of fantastic games in its library, the Game Boy Advance is often remembered for the colorful, bouncy font that greets us, as well as that beautiful melody. We'll always cherish the original Game Boy's startup screen, but the GBA was top tier. Number 3. Sega Genesis Sega! As much as we adore the Dreamcast and Saturn, the Genesis makes it to the top three for one specific reason. Care to guess why? We'll give you a hint. The sound that plays when Genesis boots up is not only the noise of a generation, but to this day is still part of pop culture. Sega! Sega may have a different chime, but it'll forever be known under this tune. All together now, Sega! Sega! Number 2. Sony PlayStation Despite being in the games industry for almost three decades, Sony is still synonymous with a legendary sound from ages ago. It is a sound that represents a time when we had fantastic titles like Crash Bandicoot, Final Fantasy VII, and many, many more. When powering on the original Sony PlayStation, players are greeted with a low rumble and that iconic gold diamond. This was the sound that gave us chills, and we loved it. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos, or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure to go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Nintendo GameCube Most, if not all of us, have seen that tiny cube tumble around to form the GameCube logo, but the two secret startups make it even better. Hold Z on one controller for a squeakier version. Hold Z on four controllers simultaneously for a tune to get you pumped for Smash Brothers. No one forgets the first time they powered on a GameCube, and its fans have made some hilarious memes out of it. In the mood for more awesome gaming content? Be sure to check out this video here on Mojo Plays. And don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.